What's up, Collective? Welcome back to the Karmic Circus, where we expose all of these karmicy ass clowns. Clowns. I haven't said that in a long time. Put it in the comments. Clowns. Okay, Collective, let's see what's going on with these clowns. Somebody got a clown out there that's trying to control you. We got a control freak as a clown. A clown as control freak. You see that? You see that? This is a control freak. This is a puppet master. Okay? Somebody that wants to control you. Have you stuck at home waiting with no clothes on? They want to try to control you and manipulate you with sex, playing mind games with you. Okay? I'm asking you, Archangel Michael, and the rest of the angels to come in and protect me throughout this reading. And any negative energy that comes towards me, I'm asking you to block it in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, I'm asking you to protect me and protect my viewers, my subscribers, and anyone that comes across this video. And I'm thanking you and asking you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you in advance. I never was the type that. Did the prayers, I always was the one to sit there with my head bowed while everybody else did the praying. So it's the energy of, of you, somebody you need to isolate yourself from. Okay. This person is not letting you grow. This person was watching you online, stalking you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so everything what is going on is, you see him right here, he's a stalker, mm -hmm. he's a stalker, he's someone who watches your page, he takes screenshots and all of this stuff, this is somebody that you blocked. You see, he, he got the picture. He screenshot you. Now, this picture that he has in the screenshot, you could be going towards this person and, and you could be walking up their driveway or coming towards their house. They could be acting like they don't see you, but they there. They see you on the camera. They know you're there. They could be avoiding you or blocking you or you could be blocking them online. I never looked at it this way, but I just seen a flash of somebody walking up in somebody's driveway. And this person is looking at you either on their... Their uh, what is it? Their their ring. Their their uh wise eye. Their wise. They're looking at you on their home security system. They see you coming up the street. They ain't gonna answer the door. Now this could be you seeing them coming up the street and you're not answering the door. And this person is trying to figure out why you're not, or you're trying to figure out why they're not. Open. But see, I see somebody here. When you're around this person, you have to wear a mask. You have to be false. You have some sort of uh, talent, some sort of gift, something you're gifted at. And when you're around this person, they block that. They're a blocker. This person also was juggling you with somebody else. Yes, I'm trying to light my little roach. There's somebody around you that's trying to figure you out. See, if you're if you're on a spiritual journey, it's somebody that's around you. Now this could be your person. For some of you, this is your person you've blocked. You've broken out of the manipulation they had you in with the third party. They was juggling you with somebody else. This is juggling. This clown was juggling you. But see, they wanted you to be in their circus 
And you, it's like they made you feel like whatever instrument you play or whatever talent or gift you have, that it was a foolish, but they the one that's in the motherfucking circus tent. Okay, this is a clown. This is somebody that's the star of the show. This is a three ring circus right here. You see this shit? This is someone who plays mental games, mind games and shit. Wasting your time. Not wanting you to grow, just stalking you. And you have a gift out here. You may play an instrument or something. You may have blocked this person too. They're trying to figure out how to play their instrument, but they can't. And this person, if you talk, if you talk, they they was they was it's like if it's not somebody you've been with, this is somebody, it could be a uh what you call a uh an enemy that was watching your page. And they was they was fucking typing. You see how this monkey got this typewriter in his lap? Everything you say, this motherfucker is writing it down. T typing the shit. And if they ain't typing, they texting the shit. They notepadding the shit. They documenting the shit. They trying to figure you out. So whatever that's coming out your mouth, they can take it to the graveyard and talk to the skulls with it. You see he got that skull in his hand, some necromancy shit. And this is a motherfucker that think they so smart when they, they'll take you around and bite you to some shit. That where they know you don't know nothing about it and have you just standing there looking alone by yourself. But somebody went somewhere, and I say this every time I see this car. You went somewhere where this clown invited you. You see, he got on a, a tuxedo. He a monkey. He's a monkey in the clown, in the, in the show. Okay? He follows the, a leader. So this is why he's, he's, you know, texting what you're saying. Hell, he may have his memo thing on everything you saying. He he's he's putting it, he's recording it. So next time when he go back to whatever event he invited you to, he ain't gonna invite you. Because see, he invited you to make you feel foolish. <coughs> <coughs> he invited you <coughs> for you to feel left out. But see, on this spiritual journey. Uh, you have to have a lot of knowledge when you when you get on this boat. I didn't graduate from high school, but I learned more on the spiritual journey than I ever ever learned in high school. In school, period. Okay? So it's like, this person is trying to figure you out. So when you go <coughs> they have an event, they ain't going to invite you. Mm -mm. They ain't going to invite you. So after you found out that they was, you know, Copying you, doing stuff that you would say using your words and your language and all of this shit, and they was having sex with you. So, oh yeah, they they being you know they getting all of your energy, having you tired, sitting at home, sleepy, all in love, not wanting to get out the bed because they didn't put it down on you, but they stole your energy, baby. That's all they did. They stole your energy and took it to somebody else. So you got to stop giving them your energy. Stop showing them love. Because the same way you showing them love, they never had that love. So they're going. Everything you do for them, they going somewhere else and, and showing that same shit what you showing it in. So stop being so kind to them. Stop being so sweet. Take back everything that you was trying to teach them about how loving and kind you are. No. No more. Because you got a thing one over here. He do the opposite of what you teach him when it comes to you. But then he'll take that shit to somebody else and do what you do to them. Cut it off. Okay? Stop letting this person waste your time. See how the numbers is falling off the clock. Spirit said, let it go. All right? And I'm going to stop right there. If this reading helped you, then please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Peace out.